Good afternoon guys. It is like 3 o'clock. I just finished this ribbon trim right here. Um, so that'll go out. I don't know why. This I found downstairs on a step. And it's one of Sterling's socks. So I just brought that up. It's a Jimbery sock. But anyway. Now it's over there. <laughs> there is the ribbon trim I just completed. I'm glad I had enough ribbon. Because I was kind of worried. Um, I still have to put bows on the shoulder straps. It's over there. And there's the hair bow. So I'm going to do that real quick. And then I'm going to head to the post office. I'll have two to ship out. And then um, so far this morning, I've been... Oh, it's dark. It's dark. It's dark. I don't know. There we go. Um, I've been working on some hair bows. I'm going to try to get... Um, those ribbon trims, or at least a few ribbon trims. The polka dot ribbon that goes with um, this ladybug set. It has not came in. The tracking says it was going to be in today and it didn't show up. So I checked it again and it still said estimated delivery was today. But it hasn't been updated since the 20th or the 21st. So I'm just hoping and praying it comes in tomorrow. Um, and this weekend we will be at, um, in Greenville at the South Carolina Comic Con. I don't remember the booth we'll be at, but some booth <laughs> we'll be at. Let's, let me check this tracking again. It just says in transition, in transit to destination, expect the delivery date. The 23rd, which is today. So, anyways, hoping it comes in tomorrow. And yeah, I'm gonna put these bows. It's through a six. Post office closes at four. So I need to hurry up, put these bows on the shoulders, and then package it all up. And I'll have to get something to eat because I'm starving. But yeah, hopefully I can get a few ribbon trims. Like, I am for sure going to try to get Clifford done. And Clifford needs to be embroidered out as well. And this is the bow. Um, she wants... Oh. She's doing it in um, light purple, red, and yellow. And so she wanted the bow in those colors. And then the number outlined in, like, light purple. So hopefully, you know, it'll look alright. Hey guys, so there has been a little change of plans. Um, I went ahead and made this one because I knew I could get this done in an hour. And that's what I had. It actually took me an hour, exactly an hour and 20 minutes. Um, but it's actually 614. So that is a little bit like five minutes fast. But I did come down when that clock right there said five o'clock. So anyway. Um, my husband wants to run to Academy to look at shoes. He needs a new pair of shoes. And so he wants to go and look at the shoes. What are you doing, little girl? But, anyway. Our house is a wreck. You need to straighten up that living room so I can run the vacuum cleaner. Um... So I'm, I have made baked potatoes, pork chops, and I'm getting ready to throw green beans on the stove, and that's what's for dinner. Then we'll run and do this real quick, and, excuse me, then I'll come home and work. But at least I got one done. We're at Walmart now. We went to Academy 
so he could look at shoes which he didn't see any that he liked That's the one. and now she's looking at shirtless Barbies Stop. Stop. Can I show him the underwear we picked out? We found some clearance underwear. They're only two fifty, so of I course we have this. to get them. I'm not. I just bought you, Barbie. You gotta earn it. Don't look so mad. But then we'll get it. And you gotta earn it. it. You gotta earn it. First we'll get it, and then I'll earn it. No, that's not how it works. Well, you already got two Barbies this week, girl. Talk to your dad. Dad, she wants that Barbie right there for five bucks. Are you gonna buy it for her? I'd rather buy that Wonder Woman thing for 20. But she can't, you know. Just wait. Now, let, lose some teeth. <laughs> lose some teeth. <laughs> lose some teeth and maybe the Tooth Fairy. Tooth Fairy will get you some money. Okay. Here's the pool we want to get. We want that. There we go. <laughs> We're home now. We just ran to Academy and um, my husband, he has to find some kind of screws. I just turned my phone on, so that's why it's making all kinds of noise. But I notice I have a red up there. Anyway, so we just ran to Academy, and then um, he was looking for some kind of screws, so we went to Walmart, and actually found strongly some undies for like $2.50, their minion. And normally a pack of those is like $9 or something, so I was like, we'll just pick them up. She don't need them, because she has plenty, but you know. Why not? Everybody loves some minion underpants. <laughs> so, and then from there he had to run to Lowe's and then to Harbor Freight Tools. But while he went there, we just ran into Burlington like really quickly, like maybe five minutes at the most. So, um, and then we had to come home because my son was locked out of the house because he went to work with his uncle and didn't bring his key, so. Yeah, yeah, excuse my flat hairdo. I haven't been doing my hair lately, like how we're putting the makeup on, <laughs> as you can tell, because normally I'm not going anywhere. Normally I'm just working. I'm still backed up on orders, but I'm I'm getting there, I'm getting there. Um, I have like a few, I got into where a bunch were overdue, because obviously if you get five or six orders in on one day, let's say on a Friday, and then five or six on a Sun, can't even talk, on Saturday, and then some more on Sunday. So you're having to turn these orders as you, you know, I don't know if that makes sense to anyone. So that means in one day I'd have to get five out, and then the next day I'd have to get five more, and that's pretty much impossible for me. <laughs> because embroidery just takes so long. Like it takes, you know, a good I mean if it is a simpler design with not not a lot of thread changing or, or steps to it like this one right here I'm going to do has 21 steps and that includes the name so that's pretty good because the name is probably and it's counting each letter as a step even though I won't change the thread but what is the name Adeline so it has six letters for the name so that's a, you know that's a pretty it shouldn't take that long um but now some of the other ones might have like 30 some steps and then like um some actually it just really depends on how much detail is in the embroidery design and i had a comment today where somebody asked me why do i uh, i don't even remember what it was i guess i could look real quick um, why do I do heat press and embroidery? Um, the main reason is to give more options, more variety. Um, 
and also heat press is a cheaper alternative to embroidery obviously embroidery is going to be more because it takes more time and more goes into it whereas a heat press it's just a transfer and you print it out and you transfer it onto the shirt and you can have more options as far as designs go with a heat press because um, I know Sterling likes things, different things than other little girls like right now she likes Buck Rogers and she likes watching Buck Rogers with her dad so um, you know we can find an image of something Buck Rogers or something in put that on a shirt for her and that's something that she likes and something she wants but obviously you probably won't be able to find no Buck Rogers embroidery design so yeah so the reason why I do both is because number one you know why not um, more options and then I also got a Cricut but I have not been able to use my Cricut like at all and I feel I feel bad because I'm signed up for it's like $9.99 a month and I didn't use it at all in February and so far I have not used it at all in March so obviously that is just going to waste ain't it so I'm hoping I'm closed down everything's shut down my eBay is shut down my Etsy is shut down so I'm not taking in any orders and I think I had 17 on my Etsy and Seven or eight on eBay. I don't know why it says three. I have to ship three. There's more than three. One, one, two, three, four, five. Five. So I have five yet because I finished one earlier. So I have five left on eBay and 17 actually it's more than 17 because one is a triple order and one is a double order actually two are double orders I think um because two let's see two are troll shirts and then two let's see orders 17 yeah it says I have 17 but it doesn't count each individual item it just counts like if you get, sell two items it's one order so there's two there and then gosh there's five shirts there forgot about that so yeah 24 25 26 27 28 29 <laughs> so about 29 left on my um, Etsy but I've been trying to keep in contact with some of the people that their orders are late. Like this one, like her, her order is like really late, like six days overdue. But again, I'm waiting for the polka dot ribbon, which should have came in already. Um, and that onesie and hair bow is done, which reminds me, I forgot to put bows on the onesie. So I'll have to pull that back out and put bows on the onesie. But yeah, that one is. And then Clifford, I'm hoping to get that finished up here. And... Then ships in one day, which is um, one of the Minnie Mouse's, another ribbon trim. I mean, yeah, some of these are going to be late, but I can't, I can't, I can't stress myself out over it. I can't, you know, I can only do what I can do, and I'm trying to, you know, work in the morning and work, actually, I work all day, honestly, on my house is a wreck right now because I can't I don't have time to clean it um it's a miracle I made dinner tonight because <laughs> they have not I have not made dinner in a while um last night Nathan was nice enough to make dinner I actually bought stuff he said he would cook so I was like I'll just get the stuff and you cook it yeah so I'm hoping to get everything caught up all these orders out and then I'm going to take a nice little break and yeah but you all know how that goes I can't usually can't stand to be close more than a few days and I'm like Arr. but um, we want to do some stuff to Sterling's room um, we want to get her a bunk bed um, I don't know where we're gonna get it we'll 
when, how, but we want to get her a bunk bed. We actually have been wanting to get her a bunk bed for like almost a year or two years. I know we looked at them. I think it was last year we were looking at them and pricing them. So maybe it was a year before that. I don't know. But we still want to get her a bunk bed for her bedroom. That way it kind of frees up some space and that if any... Um, if we had any company or anything, there would be an extra bed for them to sleep in, like if my sister came to visit or something. And, um, so yeah, we want to kind of, um, gut her room out and redo it. And, yeah. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and try to get one or two embroidered out. The ribbon trims are going to wait until tomorrow morning. Or tomorrow afternoon, I don't know. I just, as long as I can get Clifford done, the red one, I'm gonna get Clifford done by um, tomorrow, but before the uh, post office close. So that will go out, and then if the polka dot ribbon comes in, I want to finish that ribbon trim too, because that would already be the shirt and all that's already done. So, and then I need to get these mini mouses done.